the threat of an attack by ISIS is very real here in Colorado. The FBI's top leader in Denver today, and he says it's our kids, teenagers in particular, who are being targeted. 7 News reporter Mark Stewart is live, and Mark, terrorists are talking to kids using social media. And Anne, speaking to us tonight here in Denver, the head of the FBI says ISIL is using websites such as Facebook and Twitter to try to recruit young people to carry out attacks. He says the threat from ISIS is now far greater than that of Al Qaeda. The ISIL buildup overseas is gaining strength here at home. They'll task anybody. Right, they will ask anybody to kill. A chilling reality check for Colorado from the head of the FBI during his visit to Denver. ISIL has been trying to motivate people, though, to kill people in uniform. That's a threat to the military everywhere, but it's given Colorado's the number of personnel in Colorado, it's a focus of ours here. According to the FBI, ISIL is going to social networking sites like Twitter to find new recruits. The recruitment is happening here. Last October, three teens flew from Denver to Frankfurt. The FBI tracked them down on their way to join a radical group. And they have invested in this for a year, and social media works, especially on the troubled mind. The FBI director feels our local law enforcement is well equipped to handle these threats. Yet he feels there's a burden on parents, too to watch their children as the threats online are growing daily. Sometimes I get frustrated because parents who wouldn't let their child wander around a shopping mall parking lot late at night will let their children wander around the world, literally around the world on the internet. And here's what's so concerning. ISIL is recruiting here in the U.S., training people here on our soil, and then these attacks are being conducted in the very communities where these people live. We're live in Denver tonight. Mark Stewart, 7 News.